Don't be mad. I'll get a little yak for you. And I'll put a jewel in my mouth. Look. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? So you guys have seen the jewelry Christmas trees. Well, this is a framed jeweled angel. Um, you want to know the best part? Is that Janice's sister-in-law or sister made them. She makes them. Phenomenal. Um, very talented family. You didn't say price. I did say 78, did I? I did? I'm going to watch because I think I did. Okay, so Janice made this one just for the fun of it for $48. Isn't that phenomenal? Uh, so they are uh, all made with uh, vintage jewels, which are really, really cool. Um, and then I'll show you the mother of all jewelry trees coming up in a second. So hang in there. Okay, guess who made this? It's a very talented family. Janice's husband, Jim, made that. Look at that. Took two vintage saws, put them together, put lights on them. Isn't that cool for the industrial man in your life? I love that. So that is $58 on that. Some fun uh, kind of nativity scene, a tapestry happening up here. Uh, $58 on that. Some little manger scenes. Um, here's another one. This is 18 hand painted wood and it's the punch tin in the background. This one is a six piece set for $18. I love this lamp. Is this a snow globe? Nope. <laughs> I guess the fact there was no liquid in it was a giveaway. But it plays Oh Holy Night. Uh, $9. Okay, some great dishes in here. Handle with care, you guys. I'm not gonna go in there and poke around because I have butter fingers right now and I got a lot to do. Okay, love this floral arrangement thing. Tin uh, is $28, that came in a show ago. Cute little mustard table. She had a couple of them. This one is left. Okay, follow me on over here. Uh, let's do this one. Did I do that jewelry treat? $78. Now you're wondering what's happening in here. These are fine linens that have been washed pressed and ready for showtime. We keep those covered up because we are in a dusty barn. And sometimes these little nuggets, fur babies, uh, they have fur and we don't want hair on them. Okay, love this ho, 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 says the object here for $9. Some fun little things happening in that corner, including this, uh, how she made this come to life. So what I like about industrial is that you can soften it with materials and flowers and lace. Well. Hence, that's what she's done. She softened it with these little um, hand-stitched um, stockings and made it look really nice and fun in there. Cute little Noel sign up here. We're looking at $9 on that. Some stockings, $4 on the peaches or whatever they are. Some chickens, cows, whatnot in there. The locker is still here. Fabulous for a kid's room. Come on over here. We're gonna talk about some of these vintage Christmas items. $8 on this little vase. Uh, there's a, a, oh, can we get a close up on him? He's so picking cute. $5 from 1953. Look at him. He put a candle in his, in his head. Peace on earth up there for $4. Look at this little set. Where do you think it's from? I have it in my head. You guess, viewer. And let's see if you're right. Uh, it doesn't say. It's from 1960s though. $18 each or $32 for the pair. I thought they kind of looked like they were um, so like maybe from Asia or something like that, right? Fun little pieces, hand painted maybe. Russia. Russia. Good guess, producer. Okay, I like these. Uh, these are five dollars. Little puppy stocking ornaments. Super super cute. Eighteen dollars on that. Um, this guy's vintage clearly, and he's awesome. Look at that. Cherry lips. Eleven dollars. <laughs> We've got $8 on the stainless steel uh, whole collection still in the box of um, cookie, cookie presses. Thank you. I feel like I should be holding the camera. I'm losing it, Roxy. I'm losing it. Can you just do a pan in here? And if anyone has a question, I'll come back. <laughs> $7 on this little tree thing. Okay, spin around to the island. Huh? I love how she created the, the island. So this is your menorah. Uh, a metal menorah, it's only $9. I did profile this last show, but I think it's gonna show up a little bit more now. Uh, beautiful Mary and Joseph with baby Jesus. And you put a candle in them, I believe, and they light up. Holy Family, that's what it's called. Uh, dated 1973, $22. Uh, we have a little wooden Santa here, super, super cute. I love that hand carved. Oh, his toes are cold. Uh, Oh, is this? Yeah, it's Department 56. Barefoot Santa is what it's called for $12. I love that. Okay, a little Christmas tree over here. Some fun little things. This is $12. 
I love the metal tree in the middle. That's going to go fast, you guys. Uh, probably for two reasons. One, because it's awesome. And two, because she has it at price of 68 bucks. Really affordable. Some great linens. I love how she popped the table there in the front. We have the wooden balancing thing for $24. Some vintage little pieces over here, including this red table for 38 bucks. A little tiny side table with a drawer on that. Put some secrets in there and call it a day. Come on over here. I like this. I told you I have one in my house as well. $48. We can be twinsies. If you will, it's the enamel top. Nothing better than the enamel top. Shows its age, especially with the black lining. It's really hard to find. Love that. Okay. I'm so excited about this part. Why? These have the best messages you've ever read. Okay. Come look. Come look. Come look. I just want you to look at this really quickly. Are you ready for me to translate? Okay. I'm just going to do a few of them. Top one. So this means my wife is always right. <laughs> this one says... The viper that bit my mother-in-law died of poison. <laughs> this one said, sing and it will pass. Yes, true. Uh, this one says, welcome to this house. Uh, it, the list goes on and on and on. And um, they are all Italian. They're little proverbs. This one says, friends and wine must be old. Isn't that true? Um, and this one is, God, keep me away from lawyers and doctors. <laughs> There's $7 each. They're going to go fast. Somebody call me, get them, right? I'll pack them out for you. Okay, $10 on this. People are always looking for decanters this time of year. $24 on this cutie thing. We've got our peacocks here for $48. Bucks. Coming on over here, darling little pink table that just came in. My dogs are cranky. Small pink table for $72. Cute little tray, kind of matching, hand-painted. We're looking at $42 bucks on that. Some fun things in here. Tiny little knick-knacky of drawers. Uh, this is darling little keepsake here. I love this with the wood, $18 on that. Are you kidding me? You have to talk with this girl. Uh, $5 on the Christmas tree with the wire pearls. Again, I need to talk to her. <laughs> She's giving it away. Oh, gingerbread. Uh, $12 on that plastic gingerbread man with a lid made in the US. So you could put your uh, cookies and things in that and then serve it in a big gingerbread, take it to a picnic. We got a tin can here for $3, a little slate here for four bucks. Spinning on over here, look at all the baubles and the balls shining at us brightly. <laughs> okay, um, not sure what's happening right now. Just follow me, follow me. Just push pause and ask me if you want something. Disco Angel, oh, oh no way. This, like, this is so awesome. Go like this. Like, go with the disco ball. With the disco ball. Yeah, we need to get my disco ball. Look, like, literally a disco angel. That is the best thing in the barn right now, if not ever. Okay, eight dollars on that. Fun. Okay, uh, some things up here. Planner, fifty-eight bucks on this plant stand. Really cool patina. Nice design on that. She's got some vintage pieces back here. Um, the vintage ornaments for eight dollars. You kidding me? Okay, come on over here. So those of you who um, attend the jewelry workshop we're doing, uh, that's sold out, sorry, uh, but it's the um, jewelry tree workshop, sold out. But if you like it and you had fun, come on in here after the class and buy a whole jar of jewelry to do to recreate it at home for $16. We have a bunch of those jewelry jars there. $7 on the Elf, little clock here, some Christmas dishes and mugs. Okay, these are hot commodities right now. $38 on the vintage... Um, ceramic 11 inch Christmas tree. I love that. Um, a plump wife and a big barn never did any man harm. <laughs> I'm just reading it. Seven dollars people. Okay. Herb spoons made by Janice. Those are awesome. I love this little piece here. Oh, we're looking at $16 on that. The vintage set of wooden canisters with lids, $16. $5 on those. Some adorable little shot glasses with fishies on top of them, $14. They are etched glass, which are fabulous. Some vintage um, and antique, probably from the 60s, uh, office decor uh, and um, equipment. Then you come on over. <sighs> Stop. He's deaf, so he can't hear me, you guys. Okay, now for the moment you've been waiting for. Remember I told you about the mother load of jewelry trees? Well, there it is for your viewing pleasure, $158. So here's the best part. It does light up. If you don't believe me, look at the photo on our social media. Why is it not lit right now? Because we are moving so fast, I don't have the time to turn it on. But trust me, it lights up, as does this, as does this, as does this. I'm sorry, I dropped the ball. <laughs> okay, this is a 
snow globe. Snowing. This is a vintage one. And again, $5. Remind me to talk to her. Okay. A little Santa thing over here. Cute little tree with some vintage ornaments. Those are $2. Miscellaneous prices on those. Oh, we have two sets of the saws. Oh, so you can be twinsies with someone else. That's another $58. Vintage doors. She's got two of them. That is in the pale yellow off-white. And then we have one over here. Um, and it is the blue. So here's what's great about this. They have porcelain knobs, the original porcelain knobs. So come on in here. This one's $92. Um, I do have those measurements. We have four doors in the house, opening the doors of opportunity for you, this show. So winding up on that note, uh, some little knickknacks in here, fun little things. These are great if you're into crafts, DIY. Nice some collectibles in there. Okay. So hang in there. We've got one more room to feature. We'll see you this Friday, Saturday, Sunday at Brick